Verification rate. This video will outline how to determine how often the patient demographics and attachment have been verified versus the number of patients who have come in for visits within a certain period of time. So the first step is to get a denominator of the number of patients that have come in within the last month. So we're going to base this search off of a search that we've already done. So of all patients that are attached to this particular provider and that are active patients. And then we're going to specify that we're only looking for patients who were last seen within the last month. So you go in demographics to last seen date. You want the whole date because if you just pick year, month, or day, it can be a little bit glitchy in this system. So whole date is the most reliable. And you want later than let's say the first of this month. So we'll do August 1st. Okay. But we also, what we just want patients that have been seen in this particular month. So we'll add a line again, demographics. Again, we'll go to last seen date, whole date, and this time we'll pick earlier than 2016, 08, and the 31st. So now we have the number of patients that have been seen within this month that are attached to this physician. So usually you would do perform search and you would count that you would take the number that's calculated for the number of patients that meet this criteria. Because this is a test system and last seen date is calculated based on billing code, we won't have any patients that are attached to this. So let's pretend for the sake of this search that there are 100 patients that Dr. McCaffrey saw within August 2016. So you have that written down as your denominator. So now we want to find out how many patients have had their status verified. And for more information about how to verify that status, you can go to the video Status and Status Verification, where we'd like to, where we record the active status date every time that patient comes in to verify that that patient is still an active patient. So we're going to now test how many of those patients that's been done on within the month of August. So we do add line, scroll a little bit down under demographics to patient status date. Again, you pick the whole date. And first we do later than, this will look familiar, 2016, first. And add line again, demographics, patient status date, full date, is earlier than 2016, full date, 31st. And OK. And then you can click Perform Search and say that 52 patients show up with this search. Then you would divide 52 based on the denominator we had before, 100, times it by 100, and you'd have 52% of your patients whose status had been verified within the month of August.